Happy holidays. Hi, I'm Rick Guerrero, along with Greg Roden for our Armstrong Street Scene Marathon. Yep, we've started it already, but yeah. we wanted to give you a little something extra here. Yeah, and, and I think Greg's such a Scrooge. I said, come on, Greg, we got to spruce this up a little bit here. Ho, ho, ho. Yeah. Bah, you get humbug. one, I get the one with the bells on it. How's that? Yeah, just enough to annoy me <laughs> real bad. All right. Uh -huh. Where's the Christmas music? And also, I got him a pin, too. It says, nice. Well, we know you're not. Yeah, I, you get, get cold. <laughs> you get cold every year. <laughs> yes, I do. Let's so, review our season. Oh, yikes. Okay. You start off with our wonderful season we've had. Well, we started off here at the Packard Museum, and uh, it was good. We did the uh, uh, two wheels at the country fair. Is that yeah. what it was? Yeah. yeah. And that was really nice. Uh, just uh, we, we opened that it was, up that day. That, yeah, that was great. Mm -hmm. Loved doing that. Uh, about and 30, 40 motorcycles at least in here. And it, yeah. the place was pretty packed, but yeah, yeah. you're not going to... You know, it's a, yeah. it was a different world. Yeah. Well, that was that was really cool. We're enjoying the year starting off so far, and then all hell broke loose. Yeah. Yeah. So we had it all planned out, mm -hmm. and we had a bunch of car shows. We had a couple new car shows, and the bottom fell out, obviously. Yeah. So there for a while, we were doing our online uh, roll, you know, our car show, or I can't even remember what I called it now. Mm, um, it was, where we send you pictures in, a yeah. little bit of bio feature about car. your car. It was a feature yeah. car, yeah. And we did it for Street Scene Pluses and mm -hmm. liked doing that. Gosh, loved we did that. how many of them? Probably 15 uh, of them. We were maybe? doing Street Scene Pluses before that, yeah. trying just to keep keep the flow going mm -hmm. a little bit. That you, was a good idea. I'm glad I thought of that Street Scene Plus. <laughs> He thought Whatever. of it. He <laughs> thought of it. It was good. It was very and, good. Anyway, idea. that kept us going and gave you some new content at least. But uh, after that, we're like, there's nothing going on. But you know what started back up was, uh, well, we got a call from Bill Summers. Bill Summers out of Greenville, PA. Yep. He does a Heritage Cruise, which is awesome. If you're ever in Greenville, go to that Heritage Cruise because we did feature it once. We've got to go back. Yeah, well, we did that marathon. You'll see it in our marathon. That was a... Yep. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, 17 or 16, 2017? Or no, 2016? it was uh, 2018. Was it 2018? Yeah, it was that 2018. Was excellent. But we excellent. had, um, but he asked us to come. They put together a last-minute car show. It was a rolling car show, mm -hmm. and we've never done that. Mm -hmm. It was a rolling car show, and it started out with Greenville. Greenville. And where did we it went, went up, to Mercer. Okay, Mercer. Come down uh, 18, we come down into Hermitage. Yep. And then we went up 18, up into uh, transfer, and uh -huh. we ended up at the uh, now demolished <laughs> from the storm. Reynolds Drive-In. <laughs> yeah, I look up Reynolds Drive-In. Yeah. That got the storm, and it just destroyed the place. Yeah. But are they going to rebuild that? Yeah, they are well, rebuilding good. it, yes. Good. But yeah. that was a nice day, nice turnout for the car Very show. And it nice. was a nice break from the pandemic. Yeah, and everybody was staying their distance, which was nice. And we just cruised. It was a beautiful day. You know what I thought was really cool? We went through that uh, senior citizens area there and uh, yeah and, and, i forgot about that yeah that was really nice and all these these elderly people were out front waving us and it, it just felt so good just to see the smiles on their faces yeah you that's know? that's what it's all about mm -hmm. even with any car shows the smile on people's faces bringing back the memories sure. and all that mm -hmm. uh after that we we had we did uh, lowville lowville yes, lowville I, was going on and it's like let's go do lowville we love Low love, love lowville. going to lowville <laughs> If you haven't been to a Lowville show, head down on a Monday night uh -huh. because that town is almost all based around that car show at this point. Yeah, and it's beautiful. Don Denofi and those guys, they, they do a heck of a good job. Yeah. And they've been doing it for how many years now? And we've been doing it since, what, 2000. Years? Yeah, we've been doing it since 12, 2008. Yeah. And, uh, and they make you feel right at home, and there's nothing but a bunch of car guys and girls down there. And it's just so comfortable. Yeah. It's a, and it's such a nice setting down yeah, there, too. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. And on a nice summer night, it's that that's just perfect. Mm -hmm. And we did, um, what else did we do? We did the Rooster Rally. The Rooster Rally. Which Rich is Morgan was kind enough to grace us with co-hosting the Rooster Rally. And... He pulled off a stunt that nobody in the <laughs> world would have ever put. Watch the rooster rally, because uh, what did he pull off, Rick? Oh, man. Watch well, it. We're interviewing this guy in the 59 Chevy, okay? We interviewed this gal in her 59 Chevy, which was beautiful. Oh, that one was. And, and then we went next to him, and, and this guy was the guy was an older guy, older fellow, 89 years old. He was just, you, you had to love the guy. You had yeah. to love the guy. And uh, I'm talking to him and everything, and Rich is, uh, Rich is all of a sudden out of the corner of my eye, I see Rich opening up the trunk, 
and getting in the trunk of this 59 Chevy. And I'm going, uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> Inside of you, I'm going, what the heck? car it? guys, you don't want anybody touching <laughs> no. your car, let alone somebody crawling in your trunk. And mm -hmm. he's rich as picking up the the fender skirts and like, everything. You know, it's like, oh, these are pretty sturdy. And we're, I'm like, should I just stop this? I'm like, the old guy, the older gentleman was. Okay with uh -huh, it, so yeah. it's like let's just keep going. He's fine with it. I didn't think, you know, yeah. uh, whatever. I don't know what was going in the back of his mind, going get this guy, it's crazy guy, out of her car. But, yeah, really. But yeah, yeah, that, looking back, it's probably the funniest thing I've seen yeah. in a long time. And that's probably the funniest thing we've ever seen on our show. You I know? know we've seen some we've seen some doozies, uh, yeah. but that uh, Rich just adds that extra flair into any <laughs> yes. show he comes yes, to. Yes, he does. Yes, um, he does. So and we. Watch the Jerry Dixie episode. Mm -hmm. Jerry Dixie is from Street Rotter magazine, which is now defunct, <clears throat> but he is huge in the community, and he's just got stories to tell and a, an incredible wealth of knowledge. He's doing what Ohio Van and Custom? Yeah, is that Ohio, what's Ohio Van and Custom mm -hmm. um, up in Austin Town. He used to own it. He sold part of it, but he kept the the one side for classic automobile memorabilia. Mm -hmm. And this is something to see. That's what we featured. And the best part is he's selling this stuff. Mm -hmm. And he gets this stuff and he can sell it. You could buy stuff from anywhere, magazines to pedal cars. And it's really cool. Yeah, so, there's some really neat stuff in there. Yeah. And he's real knowledgeable. What he really got into was the, uh, the Soapbox Derby. Yeah, he was really into the <laughs> oh, Soapbox yeah, Derby really stuff. really into that. Mm -hmm. and, uh, but you know what? That's cool. Check out our classic episodes and you know what I want to tell you right now on if you're on our Facebook page maybe like a uh, street scene Armstrong street scene Facebook page because we had an announcement what's coming back is the street scene car and custom mm -hmm. bike show we couldn't do it last year and we were thinking of getting rid of it anyway mm -hmm. but you know what with the pandemic people are itching to get out we're redoing the whole show um, mm -hmm. we you know we loved it at Chili's and Corey Ward at Chili, uh, the, the in charge of Chili's, has been so gracious to us. I hated to move it, but you know what? The biggest complaint I had with it was the black top. Oh gosh, we it gets hot. We roasted out there, and it it's like you know, what? especially in July. And I worry about people, you know, bringing pets out and heat stroke and that. And it's like you know, is it worth it? So we're we're moving into Austin Town Park. You've got oh, trees. The grass. You've got trees, grass, some black top, and there's a lot of room. Todd, uh, Todd up at. Uh, Austin Park was gracious enough to let us use the park July 25th. It's a Sunday, 2021. Mark your calendars because mm -hmm. here's what we're going to do. We're going to have the show for three hours, not four, three. We're going to organize a cruise from Austin Town, from our show, down to Quaker Steak and Lube. It's only like three miles. So we're going to have an organized cruise through Austin Town, and that's what our plan is right now. Dick Frost mm -hmm. runs up the Quaker Steak and Lube, and he was all for it so he's going to help us organize Dick's this a heck of a guy he, we, we have so much fun when we go down every yep. those shows so austin town parked <clears throat> our show because where do you go anyway after our show they, everybody goes up to quaker yeah. steak and lube so why don't always, we have a cruise yeah. up to quaker steak and lube and that shows what every sunday night every sunday like, so it's, yeah. we're going right up right up there mm -hmm. and we'll have the after party up there so mark your calendars july 25th 2021 we are planning to have a blow blowout mm -hmm. for Armstrong Street Scene Car and Custom Bike Show. This year. We're redoing fun. the whole thing. New trophies, mm -hmm. just wait till you see these trophies. Ah. We're not doing the plaques or trophies anymore. They are custom made. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, Youngstown Cycle <coughs> Supply is helping us out with that. Mm -hmm. So they're custom Good. making the trophies. Yeah, they're neat. They're really cool. Really yeah, cool. Really cool, so, yeah. Um, but uh, enjoy the marathon. We're going to get out of your hair so you can actually watch Street Scene. Oh, wait, wait a second. Why? Is, is uh, Krista going to be doing the show with us? Um, I am going to. I haven't asked her yet. But you know what? <laughs> she has moved back to Pittsburgh with uh -huh. Realty. So I'm sure she loves doing the show, and we love having Krista. Uh -huh. She is so smart and knowledgeable yeah, um, in these cars. And pretty and everything And grew else. up with the car hobby with her brother and her parents, and she's just awesome. So, yes, we'd love to have her back. Um, it's a matter of finding another camera person to. Okay. shoot stuff so but uh enjoy the marathon yes and uh we'll see you have what? see you down the road happy holidays happy holidays <laughs>